We're going to Japan. So for the last two and a half years, my family and I have been really wrestling with this burden to serve the church in Japan, to see Japan reached with the gospel of Jesus. And I'm excited that we're now partnering with Rage Ministries and inviting you guys to come in on this journey to reach Japan. Basically, this all started when in February of 2020, my wife and I, along with our daughter Malia, took a short-term ministry trip. Um, man, we did several concerts. We preached the gospel through the help of Tim, our translator. This first song is called Joy for the Loser. Joy for the Loser. I preached at a Sunday service there at Calvary Chapel Nago. Um, we helped with kids ministry. My wife did like a women's Bible study and it was a great, it was a quick like seven day trip. But whenever we got back, this is when everything began to change because as I would find myself in prayer, I felt my heart drawn towards the work that needed to be done in Japan. Around this time in April of 2020, my daughter and I started to study and learn Japanese some new Japanese semi So we've been trying to learn the language for over two years. We're trekking along slowly. Uh, a lot of you know that uh, for over 10 years, I've been in ministry, you know, reaching hundreds of thousands through music and preaching and evangelism. And I'm so confident that the work here in the States will continue to go on with all my great friends I have in ministry who are reaching people. But Japan is in desperate need of more missionaries. The country is less than 1% Christian. And what's so unique about a call to Japan is that it's not a call just to go into the dark and not know what we're doing, although it is gonna require a lot of faith, is God has not only called us to Japan, He's called us to serve at a specific church. Calvary Chapel Nago is where we will be serving under Pastor Tim Newell. And of course, the local church is God's agent of change for the world. So a big part of what we do in Japan will be serving at Calvary Chapel Nago, helping with kids ministries uh, through music and worship, and obviously spending a lot of time learning the language, being in prayer about that. That's one of the biggest obstacles right now. You know, as we examine this call to Japan, um, we're needed everywhere, right? My neighbors need me. Uh, Oklahoma needs people here sharing the gospel. But there was a sense of a calling specifically to Japan. Not only a burden, but a love for the lost people there. Over the last two and a half years, I've lost track of how many divine appointments I've had where I end up running into someone who's connected with Japan or running into someone who is a missionary in Japan. There's been so many cool connections uh, that we've had over the last two and a half years. And then we just had to look at the opportunity and right now, there's a huge opportunity for us to go to the city of Nago on the island of Okinawa. And already the Lord has so gifted our family to almost be just a perfect fit to come right into Calvary Chapel Nago and begin to serve day one. So one thing with being in Japan on a religious missionary visa, it means that we have to be fully supported. That's a big reason why we're partnering with Rage Ministries. You know, I've had a relationship with these guys for over three years now. It's just a perfect fit and a great place to come together with like-minded believers and see Okinawa reach with the gospel. And so we pray that you would partner with us so that we could go there, that we could love God, we could love people, that we could make disciples in Okinawa, Japan. And this right here is the reason why we go. Deskara. Right now, our goal is to have feet on the ground by March 1st. So over these next few months, we'll be keeping you guys in the loop on how everything is going. Be praying that we uh, you know, can find a perfect family to rent our home while we're over there. Be praying for the whole visa application. It's so much paperwork that we're, we're knee deep in right now. And we are confident that God is gonna supply all of our needs and, and help us meet our goals that we need to get there to be fully funded in Japan in 2023. Matane.